This year's World Solar Challenge began with 32 contestants setting off on a 3,000 km race from Darwin to Adelaide. There were early dramas yesterday as Belgian favourite Yumi Car Inspire crashed and had to withdraw. The assessment of the crash looks like it's a high speed impact and um, very, very, very lucky that nobody was hurt. The Belgian team missed out on a potential top spot. They would have come across the line first, in my belief, yes. American team Principia Solar experienced problems with their solar panel. So we were just running on the batteries, but John, we once we figured that out and got it plugged in. Yeah. They did, however, finish the day in sixth place and hope the sun will give them an extra boost for the next day's racing. You can see we're set up right now, we're trying to grab all the sunlight we can because that's, that's our fuel. This year's race is the first to include an eco-challenge class. It encourages car manufacturers to sign up their hybrid cars to determine which is the greenest. Frederick Stromick, QT News.